So I just signed in to my old Facebook account that I used to have in high school because I used to have like a regular one and then I deleted it and now I have one with like 10 friends on it. But um, I was just looking through like my old pictures and stuff that I had during kind of middle school and high school time and it is honestly horrifying. I know that like everyone kind of looks back at like pictures and stuff from high school and thinks it's like embarrassing and stuff but I feel like I am just now realizing the extent of how bad it actually was. I've seen a lot of people on YouTube do like reacting to old profile picture videos and stuff um so this is like my really kind of half-assed version of that. I'm just gonna show you guys some stuff because it's so embarrassing. Firstly, um, I don't know why, but for some reason I thought it was always like really cool to like put little words and edit your pictures like that. So I have so many pictures that are just like ruined by these stupid, stupid captions. Um, here was my friend Suki and I pretending to be birthed out of a trampoline. It's pretty ridiculous and kind of gross. <laughs> This is a airplane that we made out of cardboard boxes. I would just like to clarify that we were not like little kids. We were probably 16 when we did that. Oh dear God. I don't mean to get weird on you guys, but I was like a hot mess in high school. I can say with like complete honesty that I am just so happy that that time of my life is done. I look at myself in those pictures and it's so weird because in the pictures, like obviously I look happy because most of the time when you get your picture taken, you smile or you do some kind of weird face. But I remember just being so unhappy a lot of the time. I couldn't remember like specific days on even like some of the times when those pictures were taken. Just feeling so down and not good. I kind of was very contradictory in the sense that I knew sort of who I was and I did feel like I had my own identity but I was also so concerned about what people thought and I don't even know if it necessarily affected how I actually did things because I still would do what I want and wear what I want and kind of just be how I want but I didn't feel good about it. I would kind of do it but in a very contained way and I always like to just kind of be under the radar and just not have to deal with anything. I just felt like really much like I was a part of the system and like I didn't have enough confidence or I just didn't know how to kind of break out of that which I mean I think that when you're a teenager you don't usually necessarily know how to do that. I was lucky I guess in the sense that I wasn't ever bullied or anything like that because I know that that is you know obviously it happens to some people which sucks but I was just sort of invisible. I don't even think anyone cared enough to really bully me. One of the main things that I think really helped kickstart me sort of becoming my own person and being who I want to be was doing YouTube because that was definitely not something that everyone else was doing. It wasn't because it was a trend or because I thought it was going to make me popular or cool. I just sort of did it without really thinking about it because I kind of just liked to sing and I thought it would be fun. When people at my high school would find out about my YouTube channel, I would be horrified. Like now if I was in high school and I had my YouTube channel how it is now, I would think I was like really cool. But um, when I was in high school, I would get like 30 views on my videos and no one would even care about anything. Another thing that I did while I was on my old Facebook is I creeped some people from high school, which is like kind of a weird thing to do, yes, but whatever. I, I very, very rarely go on to my old account, I don't use it for anything unless I'm just like super bored or I want to find a certain picture. The weirdest thing was that when I went on to like, you know, my home page thing and just seeing all like the feed of all the people, I didn't even recognize like so many names. And I'm sure like, I'm sure like a few years ago at the time there were definitely people that I had on Facebook that I didn't really know that well but like there were people that I knew I'd like gone to high school and stuff with and I knew I knew but like 
I can't even remember them. So I kind of just wanted to like share that with you guys. If you are currently in high school and you are... Okay, so my camera just ran out of memory and I'm not exactly sure at what point it cut off. But basically, the point of what I'm trying to say is just to not get so consumed in high school and the things that happen in high school. I'm not like saying this to be weird and be like, oh my god, I think I'm so much better than everyone or that my life is so perfect or anything like that. I was just having a little moment and just feeling good and I guess why not just spread a little positivity out into the world. Anyways, it's like really, really late and I am just like kind of out of it and half asleep. So I'm going to go to bed, but um... Hope you guys are all doing well. I hope you're all feeling confident. I hope you're all feeling positive and I hope you're all feeling loved and um I will talk to you soon. Bye.